you okay? No. Come on, go ahead. I'm right behind you. It's just a sprain. But you'll be okay. Now, you're gonna have to baby it a little. Well, we've got about an hour to make it to the camp. I'll make it. I'll help her. So will I. Okay, let's go. The darker it gets, the tougher it gets. I'll grab your pack, Pam. Here, let me help you. Thanks. Why they don't make inflatable tents? You mean like rubber rafts? Yeah. I mean, why not make roughing it as easy as being at home? You know, we should have brought a portable TV. I mean, there's nothing to do up here. Well, there's plenty. You just have to know where to look for it. You'll make it. You know, there's a trick to that. <laughs> I'm sure there is. But I'd like to do this myself. All right, if you need a hand, just say so. I said I'd get it right, and I will. I'll know I'll have an easier time with the shack. You will? Sure, simple concepts. Although a fundamental A-frame might present deeper complexities than simply utilizing a sunken floor mode. Yeah, right, of course. Got up here kind of late in the day, didn't you? You the, uh, Crestridge group? Yeah, that's right. My name's Curtis. How you doing? Ranger Campbell. Real good, thanks. If you uh, got here for dinner, you're a little early. We just got it started. No. No, the service just wants me to warn all campers. Mountain lion attacked a rock climber around here just the other day. So we're just telling everybody to look over their shoulders. Are you uh, doing anything up here besides camping? Yeah, we filed a permit to build a survival shack. Yeah, Ann's boyfriend died up here last year from exposure. Uh, we're building the shack to make sure nothing like that happens in the future. Well... I don't want to upset you folks. I want you to enjoy the forest and all. Excuse me, Mr. Uh, Campbell. Why don't you just tell us what's on your mind? Well, about eight months ago, two men escaped from the facility for the criminally insane about ten miles from here. Yeah, I heard about that on the news, and they never caught those guys, did they? That's right. Now, I really don't think that they're even in the state, much less around here, but by the off chance that they might be, there'd be a lot more trouble than a mountain lion. We understand. You know, you might think about it with all these kids here. You're a long ways from help, radio or not. Yeah, we'll keep it in mind. Well, good night. Good night. And like I say, you probably won't have any trouble at all. So you have a good stay. Charming. Maybe that's why he lives here. <laughs> Coach, Mr. Shepard? What are we going to do about that mountain lion he mentioned? The mountain lion wants to meet you about as much as you want to meet it. So don't sweat it. Well, then what about those guys? What if they're still around? That means they'd have to survive out here for eight months. I'm pretty sure they're long gone. I mean, wouldn't you be, Lisa? Well, you could tell that ranger was really worried. But that's his job, to tell us about the situation. I mean, in a group this size, I'm sure we're all going to be very safe. Well, safe or not, my body says I've got to sleep before I walk. What's the matter, Fletch? Worried about zombies? No. Actually, I was thinking about dehydration and muscle fatigue. Not to mention sleep deprivation and inhibited respiration in an elevated altitude. Incidentally, there's no compelling evidence to support the existence of zombies. Even though some primitive minds don't accept that. Well, uh, I'd be ready to walk out of here right now if we had to. I don't think we have to worry about mountain lions or crazies. All right, listen up. We're all exhausted. Let's just relax and try and enjoy ourselves up here, okay, gang? We'll just be a bit more careful. I guess you're right. I mean, if you say it's safe, it's safe. Ted, it is nice and quiet up here. Maybe we could go for a walk? A walk? What the hell for? 
I'm tired, I'm hungry, my feet are sore. Hey, Lisa! Ted, you're really something else. Hey, give me a break, will you? Caught in a snare. I'm a person, that's an animal. Had to be said a long time ago. This rope is pretty old. This Sci-Fi Channel Pro can guarantee. Who would do something like this? Pretty obvious, I think. I still don't think those guys could last up here for eight months. Did you expect me to stake my life on that? If there was someone, they'd have to count on someone to walk in on the snare. Brilliant wimp. All this damage in so short a time. You're all guessing. What we have to do is radio the ranger and keep a constant watch all night. Walt, we can take turns spelling each other. Right. Wait a minute. This could have been anything. Uh, an animal. Maybe that lion. I don't know.